Yeah, indeed. Good morning uh, from a very bad situation here, just five, six miles to the southeast on the Mississippi River from New Orleans. This is Araby, a town that was devastated uh, by Hurricane Katrina. In fact, it was underwater. And now take a look. Uh, this neighborhood with businesses uh, completely uprooted. Uh, there is uh, debris uh, really everywhere, guys. Um, it is nasty, nasty stuff. And neighbors are waking up to this reality. If you guys could walk with me, I want to talk to Michelle, who I just spoke with a second ago off camera and get her first uh, hand experience and account of last night. Uh, if you could, um, Michelle, it looks uh, to me like your, your house is okay. We were lucky. <laughs> you were lucky. Um, of course, that uh, you had a shed that is destroyed, it's correct? Gone. Yeah, the shed's gone. It's in the yard over there where y'all were. This is my neighbor's shed in our backyard. We, we were watching the news last night and saw that the weather, the, the tornado was right across the river. So I looked out the side window and saw the big funnel in the sky and was panicked and screamed to get in there. And I couldn't find my dogs to get in the bathroom. It, it was, there was no train sound. No. It, 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 and just like that, it was over with. The house rumbled and shook. And it was gone. I got to ask if you, it, when you talk about it's just over with. I was wondering this uh, when I was I've watched so much of the video. How long do you think it lasted here in, in your guesstimation? And I know it's fresh and you're still in shock. But if you had to take a guesstimate, I would say about 45 seconds to a minute. Like that that it was approaching, and we could feel it before it passed. And then we felt safe enough to walk out to the front porch, and to see where it was headed. And we saw the transformers blowing up in its path it was it was amazing it was a phenomenon to see it was amazing you guys are used to tropical systems clearly hurricanes I'm not used to torn this is my first tornado <laughs> oh my goodness I, I was just talking on air about how after katrina this area was in some spots 10 to 20 feet underwater yeah. when the levees uh broke um you guys have recovered as well as you could mm -hmm. uh and now this yeah. uh, how do you move forward you know, I, I wasn't here for Katrina. We were we built after Katrina, but my neighbors lost everything, and we were talking from our decks to each other and said, if they they were an inspiration to me because I know if they could make it through that, but this is nothing compared to Katrina. Yeah, of course, Michelle. Thanks for talking right, to us live you. on Fox Business on right, Fox Weather. Thank you. Oh, thank you for everything. I appreciate it. We're gonna walk a little bit. You be well. If you guys can, we'll, we'll walk a little bit. Richard, uh, my photographer, uh, and I, as the sun comes up. And I just want to show you uh, some more of this devastation. This is Michelle's backyard. And behind here, uh, clearly, uh, look at this, guys. Uh, this is a church uh, that is in ruin. Uh, look at this staircase here. Uh, a metal staircase that appears to have been attached uh, up there. Uh, it is now uh, on its side, uh, as, as so many things are, debris, uh, like this dangerous debris flying through the air uh, last night. It is amazing uh, right now. There is one confirmed fatality. Uh, the uh, uh, search and rescue is on the ground a little bit. And actually, if you could, let's take a look. It looks like there are engineers on the ground as well, uh, surveying the damage, uh, trying to figure out out, uh, whether things uh, are safe to move around clearly not Richard look at this this look at this guys this piece of metal just inserted flying through the air went right into here this is the kind of stuff that a tornado flips up can you imagine how dangerous this was uh, last night but take a look you can see survey teams uh, out here uh, a big tree in the middle of this neighborhood street have a helicopter above probably a news chopper uh, taking a look a National Weather Service is going to be out here taking a look at everything guys uh, but what a scene as uh, maybe Richard you can zoom in a little bit and see that car uh, really who knows where, where it started that's the way tornadoes work uh, they, things get tossed around like toys uh, and people coming in right now uh, trying to figure out exactly uh, how strong this tornado was but you know I've been on the aftermath of a lot of these and this is pretty bad damage. Um, I, I think we potentially could see an EF2 from the National Weather Service, uh, maybe a, a little stronger, but uh, very interesting to hear uh, people's firsthand accounts. Uh, she said that, you know, lasted probably a little less than a minute off the Mississippi River. Uh, phenomenal. We're going to be reporting out here all day, trying to tell these stories and certainly hoping uh, that there is no more fatalities and that the injuries are to a minimum.
I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.